got a note here from Alan in Dudley. It reads, Dear John, I've got an interview and I've heard that wearing red boosts your chance of success. Is that true? Well, there may be something in it. Statistically, football teams in red strips are proven to win more games than teams in blue. But are red clothes really a barometer for success? Time for an experiment. There's no escaping it. Colour is everywhere, and the clothes that we wear send out signals that subconsciously affect the mood of people around us. Scientists call it chromodynamics, and it's very scientific. Black says authority, green is calming, blue depressing, and psychologists believe that above all others, red is the one colour that leads to far more success than any other. According to research, red clothes are bold, exciting, full of warmth, passion and energy. A recipe for success then, Alan, but I'm not about to offer you advice without getting my hands dirty. I'm going to spend the day doing things in my normal clothes and then try them again in my red outfit to see if I'm more successful. The first test is all about being noticed and according to statistics, the best colour to be noticed in is red. Interestingly, drivers of red cars are less likely to have an accident, presumably because they stand out in a crowd, just like me in my red outfit. And don't forget, Alan, first impressions count at interview. So far, so good. Red gets you noticed. But experts also say that it can make you look and feel more successful. Mm. Well, no luck in my everyday slacks. How about a rematch? These threads should give me a competitive edge, because wearing red is actually proven to increase levels of the hormone testosterone, which in turn affects physical energy. But the way this game is shaping up, I don't believe a word of it. Right, OK. Well, clearly, this gear isn't working. I reckon I ought to go and find another opponent to intimidate. Scoot. Poker, a game of mental strategy, bluffs and balls. But again, I'm having no luck. Will my threatening red looks bring me success at the table? Red is the colour of strength, and psychologists say it intimidates opponents without them even realising. And it seems to be working. Right, I'm off to spend my winnings. Man, it's packed in here. Can I have a pint of lager, please? Would it be quicker if I was wearing my red suit? Red is the most intense colour of the spectrum, Excuse and wearing me. it is supposed to make you feel more confident. Can I have a pint of lager, please? And strangely, it seems to have worked. Great, thanks very much. Well, that's amazing. I got served straight away. I wonder what else I can find success with now I'm wearing red. If red really is a statement of success, I should have no bother blagging my way into this trendy nightclub. Oh, oh he's yeah. just going in the club there. Yeah. Hugh? Yeah. It seems red can also be seen as aggressive and demanding, and arguing with this bouncer is like dangling a red rag in front of a bull. Oh, you're disappointing me, you really are. Red hasn't helped me get into this nightclub. But how successful was it overall? Well, I stood out in a crowd, psyched out the competition at poker, and I felt more confident in the pub. Mind you, it didn't improve my physical performance, and it's still not working on the bouncer. What's more, Alan from Dudley, if you turn up for interview in this stupid outfit, you'll never get the job.